Hello, everyone, and welcome to Cato Living. I'm Jackson Jurek, joined by the wonderful Maddie Paul. Maddie, since it's harvest season, we've been on the hunt to pick pumpkins and apples. And while getting into the fall spirit, Natalia and I visited Welsh Heritage Farm out in Lake Crystal for a chance to pick some apples. Take a look. Or Harrelson, I don't know how to say that. One. So pick the highest one. See if I can reach that. <laughs> I'll pick that one up too. <laughs> These ones are. So this. This one's eyeing my name, or what is it? What's the saying? Calling my name. Aw, you're the apple of my eye. You're the apple of my eye. Did you see that wink? <laughs> you found the perfect apple. <laughs> okay, I should start picking. What am I doing? Okay, let's do that one. <laughs> Picked. <laughs> you are lucky. He's <laughs> fighting me on that one. <laughs> Got it. You could smell it. Or I did. <laughs> it was so much fun. And Jackson, I have a game for you now. Oh boy. Since obviously Natalia and I were out at Welsh's Farms, you didn't get a chance to try any of their apples. I did not. Which are really good. So they had six apple types out in their rows and I brought four for you here today okay. and I want you to try them and see if you can guess what the apples are. Now I did give him a list so there's six categories that he can choose from so we have Harrelson, okay. Cortland, Macintosh, Honey Gold, Connell Red, and Regent. So again four out of the six and if you have questions about what each apple type is I'll help you out but let's see how far we can go for today. Okay we're gonna go little to big Okay, and we're gonna try this out so if I get sick, if I get <laughs> if there's sick, a worm I'm just saying, in an apple. Yeah, a worm, could you imagine? <laughs> All right, here we go. So after your bite, tell us like what you're tasting or how firm the apple is or anything like that. This one's sweet, sweeter, on the softer side, in my opinion, when it comes to apples. I like it. I feel like I've had this apple before. Do I have to guess them right now? Yeah, why not? Okay. If you want to. I would fun. say. I would say I'm gonna go honey gold. Honey gold, okay. Okay, that's the first one. Sure. That's what, I haven't been into a green apple in a long time, everybody. Since you said honey gold as you take your bite, honey golds are known for being super crisp, and also they have an intense tart flavor, but they're very great for salads, honey golds. They taste the same. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe there's a little bit of a difference. Okay. This one's bigger, that one, I felt like it was softer. Okay. Maybe not as much sweet, but definitely juicier than the first one. I'm gonna go, well it's not Cornell Red, so okay. it's green. We're gonna go Macintosh. Okay, Macintosh for the green one? Yeah. Okay, so a Macintosh apple is actually best for cider and applesauce, and it's similar to Cortland apples. Now, a Cortland apple is soft and they're super juicy and they're known for their sweet and tart flavor. Hope this is all helping None you. None of all these are tart. Figure out. You think um, they're all super sweet? They're all super sweet. Okay. So I don't know what you're giving me here. But. <laughs> they're actually not apples. Mm. Is it cake? This is the most different. Okay. Out of any of them, that one's really soft. Um. I really have no idea. I'm gonna go Harrelson <laughs> for this one. Harrelson? That one's super soft. So we went honey gold. You said honey gold. Macintosh. 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 Uh-huh. I don't think you said one for this one. Uh we'll go Cornell Red. Okay. And Harrelson. So you named three of the ones that are here, but you got all of them wrong. That's okay, so I'm gonna go down the list and say what they are. So this one's actually the Regent apple right here, and that's known for being very light and also very sweet. This one is the Cortland, known okay. for being like pretty soft, and again, this is that sweet flavor, but kind of yeah. tarty. This one's the Honey Gold. 
that one's the honey gold. And that Love one, again, is known this. for the heart, the intense flavor. It's very crisp, great for salads. And then this one is actually the Harrelson. But you did a great job. I got it. You don't have to lie to me. <laughs> I'm not lying you don't have to, to lie. You. I tried. To, I tried my best to get through them, and obviously, I got to work on my apple skills. So, gotta start picking. Oh well, my. so to come on Cato Living, learn how to style fall bouquets in different florals for the fall season. This florist has the tips for you.